speechless. Amazing. <laughs> wow, and just everybody just watching Black Bear in Black Bear Row. I mean, uh, feel like watching a show, and uh, you know, he's he's a world champion. So you can see that you know, they're all good, but you see how uh, the actual world champion. Uh, competitor, different level, but uh, it's a pleasure to be here to be able to witness this guy. Yeah. Feel bad, everybody keep on rolling with him. <laughs> I know he doesn't have a brain, he just keep rolling. That was amazing. We are world champion, you guys. Bro, with everybody. Yeah, it's good experience. Oh, fantastic. I love, of course. You know, that was very similar, like modern style, of course. Like, I like the Lolo, I like, you know, I've been playing a lot of Barata Plata lately. Hit him from top. And so, uh, it was just interesting seeing someone better than me do what I do, right? I saw um, watching them roll with people. I saw positions I kind of get stuck in, how to like get out of them now, right? I'm really observing. Seeing how he set up his Barata Plata, is how he's like when he's escaping the back, right? He sets it up ahead of time. I thought that was pretty interesting. You know, stuff like that. That's a pretty good game. Uh, some of these like hand holes and shit. I was like, okay, okay, okay. Like his grip position was interesting. And so yeah, I picked up on a lot just by watching that real awesome. Fantastic. Chao Miao was like my favorite player since when I found out about Baron Bolo actually. Blue Belt, the beginning of Blue Belt. Found out about the Baron Bolo, what the Baron Bolo was, because I got caught in a Baron Bolo. So I'm like, what the hell is a Baron Bolo? So I went to buy it. <laughs> Baron Bolo and Beyond DVD by the Miao Brothers and that got me inspired into learning the Baron Bolo and their, their game and the, like, you know, how they play and that became, the two brothers became my like, favorite Jiu Jitsu watched their moves and watched their videos since Blue Belt and studied how they play and just try to copy their style and that kind of became my style of Jiu Jitsu and then I was really excited. I I always tell you know my girlfriend, if they ever come to Hawaii for a seminar, man, that'd be fucking amazing. I'll definitely sign up for that. And sure enough, Kiko Collective brought them here, so gave me the opportunity to train with them. And then even better, they they visit our gym, and that was that was freaking amazing, dude. That was like that was like a dream come true. Dude. He came to to, to to get to train with him, and he come to our gym too and they trained with our, all our students. That was just like something else. He was like really like, <laughs> was, like amazing. <laughs> I like no chance, I felt like a white belt. Yeah, I think he was just toying with me actually. <laughs> I was trying, 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 but I can't really do nothing to him. Yeah, he's like, like he's invincible. <laughs>